Hopefully we're beginning to feel a little bit less intimidated by the command line, but even if we don't totally feel comfortable with it, that's okay. We're not going to be using the command line a whole lot in this course anyway. But I have here a fresh terminal, a fresh prompt that I'm in my root directory at. And you can always get back to your root directory by going cd tilde. So this little tilde will take you back to the root. And if we list out what's in our root, we'll see all of the different files and folders that are contained in our top level directory. Now the next command that we're going to type is going to use that npm package that we downloaded as part of Node.js. And specifically, here's what the command is that we want to type. It's npm npm i simple-angular-server-g. Now if you're on a Windows, this is exactly what you want to type. But if you're on a Mac, you're probably going to need to preface this with the command, oops, you're probably going to need to preface this with the command sudo. And this essentially just is an administrative command that says, I'm an administrator and I approve this command to be run on my, on my machine. In Windows, we don't actually have to do that. But we're going to type this in and press enter and wait for it to download the simple Angular server package and it looks like it installed without any issues. So now we have simple angular server on our computer. In the next video, we'll take a look at how to use it.